Uh, the 49ers, uh, which I thought this was a really good trade for both sides. The 49ers traded DeForest Buckner to Indianapolis for the 13th overall pick, and they extend him and give him a $21 million contract. So basically, DeForest Buckner has been a very productive player for the uh, San Francisco 49ers. But what happened is they have players like George Kittle coming up, Nick Bosa. They just paid Eric Armstead. There's just not enough money to go around. So they figured, hey, I'm going to go ahead and turn around and get a first-round pick for DeForest Buckner. Not only do you get a first-round pick, you get the 13th overall pick in the draft. You just lost in the Super Bowl. You also have the 31st overall pick. And the 49ers don't have a second, third, or fourth-round pick. So look for the 49ers to trade one of those picks uh, and to gain some more draft capital, possibly trade a first for maybe a third and a fourth, uh, a second and a fourth, something like that, uh, to kind of get some more uh, players in that 49er system. The 49ers guys, they're very, very close. Uh, they were right on the brink of winning the championship this year. Uh, could not hold the lead in the fourth quarter against the Kansas City Chiefs. So I'm really, really excited uh, to see who the 49ers pick. Look for the 49ers to dress the wide receiver position. Uh, last year they drafted Debo Samuel. Uh, they also had Emmanuel Sanders. I'm not sure if they'll re sign Emmanuel Sanders or not, but look for CD Lamb, Jerry Judy, one of these type receivers, Henry Ruggs, one of these speedsters uh, to maybe latch on with the 49ers and to develop a chemistry uh, with Jimmy Garoppolo. So uh, also, uh, and not, last but not least, the Atlanta Falcons trade-wise, uh, they, they lost Austin Hooper to the Cleveland Browns and not long after that, they actually got Hayden Hurst uh, from Bu- from the Baltimore Ravens, who was a first-round draft pick out of the University of South Carolina in 2018. Uh, they they give up the a second-round pick from the Patriots and also a, f- a fifth-round pick uh, for Hayden Hurst and a uh, fourth-round pick. So we trade the pick we we traded Sanu to the Patriots for a second-round pick. We use that second-round pick to trade for Hayden Hurst, and then uh, we also trade basically a fourth. We get a fourth rounder for a fifth rounder in return. Uh, not a bad trade. Uh, I I really really like Hayden Hurst's skill set. He's a run after. He's a um, run after the catch kind of guy. Uh, once he gets the ball in his hands, he's a speedster. He can break tackles. Uh, he's all. He's a, he can also block. I wouldn't be surprised if the Falcons, uh, you know, got another uh, blocking tight end you know Tololo left and he went to the Dolphins uh, he, he's left and, and went to another team so uh, Hayden Hurst I really like the pickup you got a two year uh, you got two years left on his deal with a fifth year option so we could possibly see him uh, for the next three years playing on his rookie deal so I like that move uh, from the Atlanta Falcons